Once we do the draft. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, that's what I meant. Alrighty. Like, during the game. <laughs> we would have to be in the other Discord. I guess we could watch the Twitch stream. Watch the, watch the Twitch stream for the draft. Nope, nope, you can't do that. <laughs> okay, <laughs> fellas, we are we are people in the Twitch stream? Are we gonna do the draft? Oh, the draft is in Twitch? Yeah! yeah go, to go to my channel, yeah, I posted it. We have assets, Paul. We have we assets. assets. You made assets? <laughs> yeah. Oh, wait, this is professional as shit, man. <laughs> Alrighty. By the way, Paul, you also get your first draft pick. So, alright, everyone. Alright, let's, let's go through the rules one more time, just to be clear. So, rule number one, uh, players, except for team captains, can't call out anything other than pure info. No decision making at all. Uh, you're allowed to ping, etc. Uh, if you're the captain, but not if you're the player. You can just say, like, information. Um, team captains, VJ and Paul, you select all the players via the draft, you pick the agents for each player, and VJ's team... Has to have a player play Harbor. Um, the person who selects the map uh, does not get to select the side they start on. Um, all players have to follow the team captain's order. Um, that supersedes literally everything. And then players can use ults and utilities freely unless they're told a specific direction by the captain. That makes sense? Uh, also, no stream sniping. <laughs> That's the last rule. Okay, uh, and with that being said, uh, the Team Buddy Squad Force gets to make the first draft pick. There's, like, a list of people and their possible ranks that Todd posted. Um, oh, and also Rahul and Zach are a package deal, because only one of them will be playing at any given time. Cool. Each map. Each map, yeah. Basically. I yeah. see. Alright, I get to pick first. You get to pick yep. first. I want Zach. Let's go! <laughs> oh. Alright, Zach and Rahul <laughs> pick one, <laughs> unsurprising. Wait, how do I... Where do I see the current people that are not drafted? Uh, uh, the list you that have to, you have Or to look in the idea. freaking call. <laughs> <laughs> look in the freaking call. Well, hang on, I'm not entirely certain who's playing and who's not. Okay, wait, There's everyone there. Everyone here everyone. except for me okay. and okay, Sean. Okay, okay. Yeah. Go, to, go to observers if you have not been picked. Alright. Oh, if you in, the, picked, in the actual go to attacker game. attacker for Paul, go to defender for VJ. Yeah. All right. And then Zach can be coach drafting, or something for now. <laughs> I'm drafting Thomas. Thomas. All right. Paul, come to the attacker side. <laughs> what? And then pick Paul, the... pick your next person. Oh, yeah, my next person. Let's see. Uh... Let, me, let me pull up the list. Where the fuck is this channel? <laughs> <laughs> you, you can also Paul look in the game if you want. He, he has a link. Fucking a, Rahul yeah, just yeah. replied it. Okay, I got it. I got it. Uh, so I already have Rahul and Zach. Let's go with Wally. Wally. Let's go! <laughs> <laughs> okay. Zach's really ex that excited was, about that. That was actually oh, no. a big pick because it takes away the it only takes away the only Harvard. person who knows harbor <laughs> <laughs> Paul accidentally you know, just made the biggest the play the strats. all right uh, Varun, you're with me Varun goes to VJ's squad let's go Alrighty. Paul all gets right. the next one um let's go with uh, Juan. Juan. Alrighty. Oh wait, Todd's still on the board. Todd. <laughs> Todd is. <laughs> Todd is, in fact, still on the board. <laughs> yeah. That was a. 
<laughs> Who's last? Yeah, it's, Chris. it's Chris. Chris, There's Corey and Chris Corey and Corey are, Corey still, are still on the on the table. All right. Um, see, the thing is, Corey gets tilted really easy. <laughs> <laughs> So, Corey. <laughs> All right, what, was, what does Chris think, do? Does Chris get? To, gonna... I think we should draft Chris as well. So Chris yeah. gets to go on VJ's team, and then he subs in in the next map. What? Wait, no, what? He, he, he Chris gets five, to go in. That's five, five and five. Oh, wait, do we have? Oh, I thought we had one. Extra. Never mind. I'm chilling. <laughs> I'm, I'm an idiot. You think I'm gonna? You think I'm gonna tilt in a fucking yes. five and five? <laughs> no, we do. No, we do. He's already. Paul, he's already tilting. Paul, he's already on the other what? side. Paul, move to the attacker's box. Move to the. Attacker's All right. Box. Well, okay. Wait. There's a. So we have no, 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 no. in the, in in the, the custom. In the, you can. The everyone board. can leave the Twitch stream unless you unless you want to watch it now. You see the little arrow under arrow. Corey's name. Click on it. All right. Corey's name. You see Corey S nine nine in Valorant. Jesus Christ. Right under it. There's an arrow. <laughs> Click on the spot. Yes, there is. Right where I just moved to. That's where you should go. All I see is the main menu. <laughs> oh, what? Oh, hit, hit play. play. <laughs> <laughs> Click underneath Corey. Oh, there, there, we there we go. There we go. All right, Zach. Okay, wait, uh, Zach and Rahul. Which one is? Which one of you is casting match one? I'll cast match one. Okay, then hey, jump I into a. We'll cut the dead air, right? See, we got a whiff, right? Or we got a vamp. That's what the. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. This so, is what they do uh, during after, tech pauses. <laughs> yeah. So after Icebox, of course, our next map is going to be Haven, where um, VJ's team picked. Did they pick defenders or attackers? They picked defenders. They picked defenders first, which is an interesting decision. Uh, I think he picked randomly because he didn't know what map it was. So this <laughs> is really going to be an interesting map. It, it, once we get there, of course, Icebox is obviously our first map. Um, so it's a what bold we, move what, to what pick at random. To, what what agents are you expecting to see on this first uh, coming out of, from both teams? Well, Let's start with uh, Team Buddy Squad Force. Team Buddy Squad Force. I'm seeing uh, probably. Uh, Ice Cold Narsh picking up the Viper. I think that's a pretty easy mainstay for him. Um, I could also see him going for a more unconventional controller pick like Omen because I do know Paul also plays Viper sometimes. So that might be an interesting uh, conflict. Um, I'm gonna. S I'm pretty sure Corey is gonna be locked into the Killjoy. That's his mainstay. But maybe we could see a nice KO counter pick out of it. Not quite sure. Uh, Sly Fox is either Chamber or Breach. I don't think I've seen him play anything else. So he used to. He plays a lot of Sky. Oh, so really? Don't forget. Alrighty. Yes, he plays a good bit of Sky. And I, if I saw a Chamber, I would be quite disappointed. <laughs> That's probably oh. true. And uh, Aqua Jack of all trades. My money would be on either Sova or Reina, depending. Alrighty. Let's start the game. Let's get going. Now I'm gonna suggest a a uh, a curveball. What if? Paul, in a moment of solidarity, picks the harbor for his team. Well, we're about to find out. So we're oh, here in boy. Oh, the insta Oh, the agents are being locked on already. Lots of information. We have your lost dog on the KO and Tabi Show on the raise. Who Very could have been surprised pick. by that one? He's called Narsh on the Viper. Very powerful pick. I think the Ooh. captains have made some great decisions so far. Paul is playing Phoenix. That's going to mm. be interesting. And, of course, Corey on the Killjoy. Good call on Juan playing Sky. And Rahul on the Reina. We're just yeah, I know yeah. Wally no, is it's, the post it's plant fine. man, and then Rahul plays Silva or Reina. Correct. I I, and then yeah. I play Juan... KO or Killjoy. KO or Killjoy. Oh yeah, I remember you playing KJ. And then Juan, you play. Don't you like am... KJ? Uh, I can do mostly anything other than smokes. Okay. So like I usually go for initiators or flashes. We do have like... the only two people who play controllers, which is kind of nice. <laughs> no, I also play controller. I well, play. Like, I'm main omen. Uh, Varun, Varun's I've played. Varun, Varun will Varun flex into things. brim. But... Yeah. <laughs> I, I, yeah, no, he's pretty met at brim. We got this. <laughs> met at brim. Okay, just because you have smokes doesn't mean we're gonna win. All right. Just, just <laughs> no, I know. I'm just saying. Hot take: Smokes aren't. Uh, are we ready then? Is everything on us? Yeah. All right. I'm gonna say. Corey should play KJ. Juan should play uh, Sky. Rahul should play. Uh, 
uh, Reyna. We'll Wally, have time to do okay. this in the in the thing. Wally should play. Uh, Wally's the post plant master. Can you still post plant with Viper? I think so. Ish. Ish. I mean, I... Yes. Is there an is there a new person who post plants better? All right. Well, no. you'll play Viper. No, I don't think there is. All right, and then I'll play whoever. So we're ready. <laughs> you'll play whoever. Do you even have everyone unlocked, Paul? No. So I'll see who I have unlocked. <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> oh shit. It'll probably I be Sage. Let's make be honest. Play Harbor. Wait, there's so many people in this game hmm. now. So we're playing with only one duelist? No, well, it depends. It's... Well, I, mean, I guess it depends. Paul's done a good I'll job play this it. guy. <laughs> okay. Alright, yeah, we, we can take that. That's, that's cool. That's Perfect. Cool. That's fun. And then on the other side, VJ looking towards locking his trademark Sage. I literally don't think he's played anything else in his entire Valorant career up till this moment. I have to say, I am enjoying the uh, Team Buddy Squad Force comp right now. It seems pretty well-rounded, and they have uh, a lot of good potential. Yeah, they've got one of every role, and of course, <laughs> <laughs> ASDF Pilot playing the harbor as required. Uh, you know what? Real respect for him for taking taking that bullet for the team. Well, he says taking the bullet. That was, of course, passed down to him because he must listen to the the supreme will of his team leaders. So, it's just this is true. Much of a choice. Um, and it looks like Mr. Clean is hovering the sky. We'll have to wait 10 or 15 more seconds to see if that's going to stay. Oh, no, maybe swapping to the Killjoy. Mm, you're going for the double Sentinel play. That's interesting, considering they only have one Duelist right now. They are also... Oh, oh, oh. He's oh, really he's playing with the timer on this one. And it looks like Sky is going to be the pick. Interesting. Initiator, I think, again, another well-rounded thing... Uh, team i'm not too sure on mr clean's experience on initiators so we'll have to see how that one plays out i've seen him play ko before but i don't think i've seen him run sky yeah Just that out. makes sense that's All right, guys, that was the general I, strategy yeah. is to target todd so how explosive is he gonna be as a general rule we're gonna try and target him Alrighty, we've got Valpals clustering up. Oh, they're partaking in the ritual. Of course, this is a, an Iron One Gang classic. Of knifing ritual. the pipes. Mm -hmm. uh, Very important. They, these haven't taken too long, though. Here, let's send a message. Um, wait, so, okay, wait, I'm going to go A. Uh, Rahul, you take mid. Oh, right. uh, Corey, you go A with me. The other two go B. Okay. I forgot that I have to wait for you to tell me where I can go. Is there stuff to set up? I don't know. Toss a wall right in the middle of everything, I... if you have it. Am I allowed to use my you own? You set up your turret like somewhere where it's gonna really irritate them, Corey. Okay. And uh, I say what we do is we sit and listen, and whoever hears them coming flashes them, and we run out and shoot them in the face. Wait. So am I? I'm allowed to use a little bit of autonomy for where I. Put oh yeah, my yeah, yeah, yeah. Right? So you're you're not okay. a robot. I'm controlling. You just basically like if I don't give you a command, you interpret. Got it. Okay. Uh, we see the. Sky and Viper stacked towards B. We've got Reyna playing up in tube, and then Killjoy and Phoenix playing on A site. And of course, the Valapals seem to be stacking the A site. I'm going to get a nice POV of their entry over here. Wait, I can't even see chat. Oh, it's probably a okay, toggle. The, game, the rounds are starting. Alrighty, we have so, a whiffed KO knife <laughs> into so Bell. It looks like they're starting with a hit onto A, but not B. Um, they're they're here. They're oh, A. Some belt. Come A. Rotate A. Luck. Uh, well, from watching, watching the perspective of uh, VJ here, Down he's dying a. to the turret. A uh, very interesting play by him. I saw Corey pull a uh, nice couple of kills. Your lost dog is coming with a sortie strat, and he's dying to the molly. <laughs> decision on his part. Yeah, I'm not sure how I feel about that play. Um, that turret really like doing a lot of work for the Valp yeah. or for the team buddy squad force. Oh, but they seem to have it, won that round quite handily. It, Two still alive, upgrading the guns, and we're back in pre-round. Pause in the match timer. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Toss a wall just like in the middle of everything. Actually, can you do it so that it'll um. Like, I don't know how to ping in this, but you know the part in A where they come through? Like, can the wall go across that? Like, across in which direction? Like, like between pipes and belt? Or like, 
Yeah, where the orb is on a... Here and here, between these two. Yeah! I like, I like the the pre-round timer being paused, because it gives me a lot of time to fuck up my setup and re <laughs> redo it. <laughs> Alright, so the round is starting again. It looks like um, the Valpals are considering another A hit. Let's see how this one pans Ooh, out. Ooh, a KO knife that works! It looks like Corey is suppressed over there. Oh, nice Marshall kill. pick. Parachon is sitting in maze with a flash. He gets two of them, including BJ. Oh, a fight in mid. Uh, unfortunately, Rahul loses the duel to Mr. Clean, Spike but he's got help a. coming. Ice Cold Narsh coming up mid. We're watching him. Oh, he picks off the sky instantly, heading straight into the site. Corey up top with a uh, marshal, scoped in. Remaining. Oh, but it's Ice Cold Narsh that gets the kill on Thomas, and there's just the harbor left in maze. Oh, he gets one! Three. He's gotten one. Let's see, can he clutch this one out? He seems to be sticking around. Not sure what the IGL uh -huh. call on that is. He takes out the sky. It's a 1v1. Controller versus controller. Oh, he got another dink. He seems to have a pretty good chance. Now, unfortunately, he's playing the worst agent in the game. <laughs> That's true. So, Throwing up the high tide to try and disguise his position. Let's see if it let's actually see. fools Wally. Oh, this might be a bit of a timing. He's not really sure where Wally is. They don't oh, see each other. what a clutch! What a clutch! And he gets the spike plant. Rotating. There's, there's one in the in jail. One in jail. 80, I killed BJ. I killed BJ. Eighty-one sky. Sky's dead. Oh, he's above you. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't see him. That's on me. I was, I was a very bad sensor. I got, I got gun diff. Oh my god, we lost the. All right. Horse. That's no good. Uh, I'm gonna buy a Spectre again. Force it. Force it. Force it. Okay. Force it all the way, or um, way, as far or? as you can go. I just want to say I wrecked Chris that round. Shoot him in the face. I did. I just want to say I got ping diffed. I got gun diffed. I got diffed. <laughs> I killed BJ, so I'm the better captain. Uh, I would expect, based on the success of that round, that they might uh, attempt another A hit, but uh, obviously it's up to the IGLs to decide what to do. That's true. I wonder if uh, the Team Buddy Squad Force uh, crew is going to change up their current defensive strategy. Or if they're going to stick the same. It has been working, but will it keep working? That's the question. In the face of... Unfortunately, it seems Team Buddy Squad Force's buy is not super good this game, this round. So they're going to have to be play a bit safe if they want to get picked off. That's true. I do see a couple of not-so-great guns on that team. Although, you know, they've been known to be nasty with the Stinger. It looks like it's going to be a B site hit with all five from the Val Pals. Let's see how it shakes out. Who are you watching, Zach? Uh, looks like a slow push through B long with uh, your your lost dog uh, lurking up in the mid. I like that nice they uh, I like that they knifed A to try and delay the rotate. That's pretty smart coming from uh, a VJ call. Uh, Wally Let's doing what he does the best. Mid. Ice Cold Narsh, or Your Lost Dog, has seen a couple, but unfortunately he has been pushed out. Oh, and he really still kills though. them! Rahul with the trade. But In they the meantime, do seem to be uh, executing B site quite effectively. That's the Smokes player down, and B site seems to have been taken. It's a 2v4. So it looks like the uh, the defenders are using a split retake option. I can't say I'm a fan of this one, as they're probably going to get picked off, but uh, it seems that like Corey would pick in, in long. It's pretty good. It's only 3v2, and they have much worse guns. Rahul is on site. Corey getting a 4k with the Marshall. Not Marshall, Guardian, excuse me, for the defuse. 80 on raise. I did 63. They do have a healer. Oh, they're all oh clustered. My God. Push them, push them. One enemy remaining. Oh, he's correct! Oh, oh he's correct! Oh. <laughs> oh my god! Oh, Push him! <laughs> Nobody look at you! Holy shit! <laughs> uh, what is this clutch? 
What did he say? <laughs> it said, well, Wally's just said, push the, uh, quote, push them in chat. So I think that was, <laughs> yeah, the, that the, was strategy. the That was the, the strat. Strategy. Push them. A nice look into the mind of uh, of Paul in that situation. I see some trash talk going out in the chat. Uh, a line from Rahul, Mr. Clean, more like Mr. Cringe. Oh, uh, that's, that's got to hurt. Right there. You know, if there's one thing I know about Todd, it's that when he starts getting tilted and playing snipers, it might spell disaster for the Val Pals on this one. Mm, this is true. It appears Rahul did not mean to trash talk Todd, so he apologized. But, uh, <laughs> hopefully he'll work that one out in the future. Looks like another classic A sight hit for them. Uh, Chris partaking in the ritual. Let's see if it pays off for him. Uh, yeah, he only did a couple swings, but it, I, a few of the members are considering uh, what to do here. I'm going to be uh, watching Tabe Macho in mid. He's got the Sheriff, and if there's one thing I know about this man, he's nasty with it. So let's see if I it provides some value. I think I'm going to keep an eye on Rahul up two, because he'll probably be the first line of defense uh, for the mid push. And immediately we've got a boom bot into mid. There was a knife thrown. Not sure uh, if it's hit. Pushing up, to tube. push up tube. Oh, he's gotten taken oh. out by Rahul, who dismisses out of the way. Uh, there's still a lot of people in tube. Oh, and Corey manages to catch Varun peeking out. Good flash in mid by Paul. Really Rahul takes pick. out yeah, Todd. Oh, Chris pulls off a 2K with the stinger, and it's a 2v1. But the spike is down. 3v1 even. But the spike is down in a pretty bad spot. Uh, your last dog has at least recovered the gun, however, so... Ah, but he's taken down. Rahul Aqua with the 4K, and that new Valorant, uh, lock-in knife to show for it. Man, oh man. On me. Wait, there, oh, by he's back. Push the the yeah. just, just run around him. Come from all sides. Alrighty. But, uh, I don't believe that, uh... That the Val Pals are out of this one just yet. No, um, as we all know, the side change can definitely change things up, especially given that uh, the Team Buddy Squad Force is going to have to attack with a Viper and a Killjoy, neither of which are, you know, incredibly attack focused. All right, seems like it looks an like A hit. Setting up for another A hit. Um, I don't think this ritual has been going on, Zach. That might spell disaster. Yeah. Yeah, it looks like this is going to be a pretty even buy for both teams, a, a full gun round, so uh, this will really be a skill to, to test the, or a test of skill for the rifles. I'm going to be watching uh, our resident harbor ASDF pilot. I want to see if he uh, makes I, some moves. I'm taking a look at uh, Corey, the Killjoy player. He, he currently has a champion's aura, so... That's a harbor uh, ult heading into A site. It's going to push... Well, Corey and... Paul are staying on. I'm not sure if Paul yeah. knows what the ultimate does, and it results mm, in him getting killed. Him. Although he does get some nice chip damage with the wall, but it seems Corey like... Corey here. He's, he's taking a, stalling the enemy team as much as he can, and he's taking a kill. Seems uh, like, oh, the Team Buddy Squad Force is retaking with a vengeance using that Killjoy ultimate and Reyna ultimate to go through. Uh, pushing VJ well off the site, right into the jaws of Ice Cold Narsh, and he takes him down. Four that was one. A beautifully executed retake from Team Buddy Squad Force. Really I'm surprised. Game. I'm surprised Paul was able to call that so effectively. He knew that the lockdown would force VJ out, and he already had a player going mid to take care of it. Uh, well done from him. Oh my God! Oh, Wally put up the wall. Here. Wally put up the wall. Uh, are we staying on me? Oh, One's on the rope. <laughs> Alright, let's see. Strike uh, down A. I'm blind. Go rafters. Can anyone take flank? <laughs> Alright, Wally, go for the flank. One enemy remaining. Oh, fuck. Oh, wow, you guys cleaned up. What? I have gotten a lucky to kill on the... Uh, yeah. Perfect! Seems like uh, the Val Pals are going for a B-mid split with Mr. Clean the Sky pushing mid and the rest taking down B. Um, however, it, Team Buddy Squad defenders... Force is, is playing very aggressive in mid. There's a couple on Boiler and one in Tube, and then even Sly Fox on B-side is looking towards uh, mid as well. Seems to be primed and ready with a flash as well. Uh, this could uh, get interesting. Look. Right. Okay, okay, okay. 
Yeah, that's, just, uh, that's how this works. Oh, like, right, 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 I'm just trying point. to make sure I'm not cheating. Death ball down yeah. mid, let's go. It, like, it, oh, okay, uh, well... <laughs> death ball mid, come on. <laughs> oh. Well, I have to listen to that. <laughs> okay. What are we doing? Death, death ball mid. mid. Pardon? Just, what am I doing? Mid. We're just pushing mid. We're, we're, we're pushing me? mid. Everyone, yeah, there, everybody's everyone. pushing mid. Is there Everyone's a strat after that? Uh, the strat uh, we'll is find out how many of us are still alive. Uh, let's see, he's probably most likely playing entry down B long. He does looks only like have a, that a share. Full five man B push down uh, mid. Or five man push down mid. Yeah, this is gonna no. be interesting. They did lose the Phoenix ult over there. Not sure how that's gonna work out for them, but. Seems like a pretty just... free B site, however, they are not watching the flank at all, except for VJ with the slow. Oh, and now the team util comes in. That's a grenade. There's about to be a fight over on yellow. It looks like your lost dog is, is looking for a, a cover, and he, he's found Paul. Oh, he man. He has a bit of a trigger discipline. pick. All right, it's a 3v4. Or 3v3? 3v3? 3v2. 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 But Mr. Clean is at a bit of an HP disadvantage. Your uh, lost dog, lost dog. Nasty with the Guardian. Oh, he's oh and it. he cleans one him more, up. 1v1. 1v1. Mr. Clean is uh, not looking very healthy. And of course, Wally hits it. Ice Cold Narsh uh, finishes off the round and he's most likely going to get this defuse. That was a, a, a tough battle, but the defenders were able to pull that one out. 5-1. Now death ball. Now death ball. Let's go. That was go. from A side. That was from A side. The knife was I from the B side. I hear a lot of footsteps B main. The, yeah, the, yeah, 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 the, yeah, the knife was from B. the B side. Corbin B. Last player standing. One yeah. enemy remaining. This guy was up top. Should I defuse or attack? Uh... I was gonna say they're no longer... Sorry, <laughs> 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 Was there a blue on that graph? Don't lie to me. <laughs> there was a lot of blue on that graph. <laughs> <laughs> 5-1. Five, 5-1. Five, this is starting to look a little bit one-sided. Uh, Unfortunately, I have to agree. Not sure if VJ's map pick is really working out the way that he had hoped, but... I will have to say, the evidence that the team captains are really putting their all into it is shown by the fact that they're both bottom fragging for their teams. <laughs> and they have very similar score lines. Yeah, we it seem to like be going round... for another mid-hit from the Val Pals, and uh, a pretty default defense on Team Buddy Squad Force's side. Uh, I think Aqua's probably going to get first contact in this, so let's see what happens. I, I've got my eye on Aqua. Let's see, he's taking contact in mid. They're taking advantage of the Harbor Utility, and they're pushing up into two. There is a lot play. up in the tube right now, and Aqua is not really there to counter it. They're going to have to defend the site. We're watching uh, Juan right now. Gets a nice pick on Thomas. And down, Wally please. with the kill on Varun. I'm watching Your lost Chris. dog has taken some space on the site. Uh, unfortunately, uh, the duel. Ah. Uh. Clean and defenders clean up right there. Yeah, that was a that was a slaughter once the team took contact. Paul picking up a fish vandal. That's that's gonna be good for him in the next mm. round. I'm predicting course, a know, predicting a win here. Wins. That's that's true, definitely. Right. No knife. No from knife is mid. Oh, are they death balling mid? Let's de let's go. Let's match it. Oh, we're matching it. Okay, they're going up the tube. I'm gonna go up tube. Uh, bomb. Down, B. Oh my god, kitchen. Just one the two. Another Inside. kitchen. Another kitchen. Another kitchen. Last one kitchen. No. I am so bad. Alright. Oh my god, VJ nice. has two kills and they're both me. <laughs> 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 oh no! What are you gonna do? Alright, can we get Rahul an op? Is that a thing we can do? Cor we had, we've had a query in the chat. VJ is asking, Corey, how is your tilt level? <laughs> so, um, as we know, Corey, easily tiltable player, and uh, the Team VJ, Team Valop House, might be looking to take advantage of it this round. Uh, uh, looks so like an A side. We've got a knife back side to take out that Killjoy utility. Very smart. Uh, Paul appears to have whiffed the Phoenix wall. That's rather unfortunate. But uh, his Viper wall is going to protect him anyways. Thomas shooting the ult. Can he find anyone screen. with He's it? Looking for screens. Oh, He's able to find one. Classic he Thomas damages right Corey though, puts him at half health, and Valpals appear to have taken the site. They've pushed most of the defenders off, only netting one kill, however. 
And it seems Aqua is using the the op for a retake. Interesting play by him, but uh, it might be his only option. Uh, Mr. Clean seems to have spotted the flank coming in from Ice Cold Narsh and Sly Fox. Hopefully that information is going to be useful to his IGL. I suggest you move. Oh! Interesting plant spot from Mr. Clean. I can't say I agree. Uh, unfortunately, he gets spotted out by Aqua and taken out. Your lost now, dog cleans up Corey. This is a pretty. This is as even of a round as we could have seen from the Valp Palace. Thomas taking down Wally. That's controller ability gone, and it's left with Rahul up top. Rafters with the op and Juan in nest with the Vandal. Brune uh, making a circle space on Rafters. And oh, really good trades. Good trades. Good trades. It's now a two v one. Although Thomas does not have a lot of health. Wonder what Juan's going to be doing. Uh, let's look at his POV right here. He's trying I'll to see a, if he can a look find uh, any range this. It looks like he's going to have a bit of a timing. Really good cross player. Ooh, good up. pick. Oh, but it's taken out. And Valpels get their second round of the game. Just when they needed uh, it, I think. Really great swing from Astiff Pilot there. I think the Harbor really had a great showing that round and really brought their team the win. Yeah, I was really impressed by that circular wall he put out when they were blocking the retake. That's two sets of slows for people to cross through. Awesome. Rush it. No! A bit high. God, VJ almost killed me again because I was on, like, 30 HP when I started fighting him. We've had another uh, another call out in the chat. It was quote Teabag Wally, which is of <laughs> course uh, an important call out. I imagine both IGLs are interested in trash talking the other teams. Taking so a this is page a... out of Dapper's book on that one. Mm -hmm. uh, looks like they're setting up for a B hit with your lost dog setting up for a knife somewhere in mid. We don't really have anyone playing aggressive mid on uh, the team buddy squad for us. The closest What's thing the is Rahul of... playing Follow kitchen. Projectile? Oh, we seem to be having a bit of a team fight in B main. One going for either show. side. He's using some utility to take some space onto site. It looks like he's about to peek towards yellow. Oh, uh, really, he gets killed. Really good spacing there. Um, All right, Cy Fox is looking to, to stop Ooh, the. Oh, uh, we've got a Reyna ult pop. He's sneaking behind the wall. Let's see if he can capitalize. I have to say, really good wall. Oh, from, he uh, whiffs so hard. Really it is right, now so a 1v2. 1v2 for Mr. Clean. He's popped the Seekers. Let's He's see popped the Seekers. Paul oh. has gotten blinded by that, but of course, Corey cleans it up. Seems like that one round is just going to be one round. And let's take a look at this crazy cool finisher. Go to me, go to me, go to me, go to me. Go to you. Ooh, that's a great view of it. Oh, the yellow? Behind the big yellow thing. I've got your trail. Watch your eyes. Nice. Nice. I defuse. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Seven two four. Uh, team buddy squad force. Things are looking a little bit dire. If. Valpals can make one more round though. They will have the 9-3 curse. Honestly, I think the game changer in this match has been Valpals' refusal to do the ritual after the first round. It's really disappointing. I have, to, I have to agree with you. The ritual is, of course, an extremely important part of winning any game on Icebox. Let's so. see if they can let's see if they take the time this round. Looks like the harbor might be gearing up for it. He's got a knife. He's got the pipes. Is he gonna do it? He doesn't. He knifes next to it and leaves. <laughs> That's just bad luck right there. I I'm disappointed. Say. Honestly, you know what? I think Team Buddy Squad Force deserved to win after that disrespect. I see a oh, sky flash. Blinded. Catches a couple people. We got his sheriff coming out. Doesn't quite oh, see seems... anyone. Oh, Ooh, oh and really he gets out sniped by the Vandal. That was a great shot by Paul. He's still holding the same angle. But of course, the turret catches the two in a main. B side players seem to be rotating an through. Sp split play from the Valapals. They've got two hiding in garage, and it looks like they're waiting for the lurk. That we'll is going to be dangerous. There are three people lurking through. Will they spot them they out? Don't have, they don't have the guns. And they oh, they have shorties. There. They were waiting for a B lurk, not a mid lurk. That is so unfortunate. All right, guys, rotate flank. There's another there. Oh, Holy sorry, I'm not allowed to ping. I, that was cheating. I will sit in the corner for a couple seconds to make up for my cheating. 
I hear footsteps B. Oh shit! All right, let's go, Corey. Last two, last two, uh, CT. It's currently a two v three. Uh, Astiff pilot is. He's got up three. With the Phantom. He's got four. He's, he's on the ace. He's on the ace. Let's see if he can finish this one off. It's Astiff pilot versus Corey. They both have almost full health. I'm watching Astiff pilot. Let's see if he can get our first clutch of the game. It looks like Astiff pilot is taking some space. He's uh, using his his orb to uh, protect the plant, but he's not planting inside the orb. Interesting play, perhaps a bit of a diversion. I think he was expecting Corey to come in from uh, exactly where he's coming right now, but I think he expected it a lot faster. Oh, Corey appears to be heading up tube. He's using the butterfly knife, which is pretty sick. I didn't know he had remember... that. And, and there it happened. goes. And here it comes. Ace! We, and we have our ball. first Eight. core Eight. ace of the game <laughs> the core ace rj clutch well done by asdf pilot that puts his team at three setting him up beautifully for a 9-3 curse very uh, impressive i have to say the strat calling from uh from vj that round was extremely impressive i especially like the shorty and garage strategy it seemed to work out really well and the uh the vj ace or the varun ace uh, proved uh -oh. to be extremely effective <laughs> All right, well, hopefully reinvigorated by that, uh, although it seems like Team Buddy Squad Force on a slightly light buy. Aqua's got an Ares, but not that bad. Uh, let's see if they can keep the momentum going. And he gets two players with it. I only There's caught the tail of end of that, but it was really cool. <laughs> a bit of a team flash there from Mr. Clean. Classic Sky play right there. Um, Corey is taking oh, some space in mid. Up. Let's see if he uh, catches Tabe Macho. We've got a whole crew of people heading up tube. They're falling straight into the defenders. Ice Cold Narsh goes down. It's currently a 3v2 in favor of the attackers, and all three of them are just outside of mid. Sly Fox, now the let's... only one on B site, uh, although the res comes in, and we have 4v2 at one this point. Remaining. Corey it's goes down. V1. Juan picks off ASDF Pilot. He's falling off a little bit. Oh, and it's Sky versus Sky. Mr. Clean wins. That's a fourth round for the Valpals. <laughs> Very clean 3K for half. Mr. Clean that round, and it seemed that the uh, the split push down mid was seemed pretty effective. So the it looks like the Valpals are considering another A hit um, while the defenders are still getting set up. It looks like they've changed their setup up setup a little bit uh, with uh, Paul looking to take some space in mid. I'm going to try and watch this KO knife properly this time. Oh, and he catches out uh, Aqua in mid. Oh, and in the sniper battle, Marshall beats Mr. Clean. Corey S99, very clean with that. We have a KO ult popped on A. Let's see how that turns out. Lots of uh, KU till to use to take space on site. Uh, Your Lost Dog is pushing. Oh, and, and a suppressed a Aqua orbit. gets killed with a gun diff from Asdif Pilot. However, Ice Cold Narsh coming in with the wall. Let's see if it can make a difference. Corey with Corey's the Marshall. Popping off. Get... He's got two already. Will he get a third? Oh, it's you just too much for him. The save round really affecting that there. Oh, and Your Lost Dog cleaning up. And it's down to Sly Fox on the flank. Can he win the 1v2? Thomas is looking in his direction. Oh, but he falls off the angle. Oh, he gets the dink, but it's not enough. That puts us at a 7-5 half. What a excellent exec there from um, Team Valopals. They really took advantage of the utility and were able to take a lot of space on site. So big props to VJ for that one. Yeah, and of course, we now have the map switch in place, uh, or the side switch, gonna, excuse me. We're going to give them a bit, of a, a bit of a longer pause this time to change setups for the opposite side. So hopefully they can uh, really, the, the IGLs can get some good strategies. Seems together. like there is some, a little bit of uh, slow movement out of uh, VJ in spawn. Is he typing in chat, Zach? He, no. The only chat message has been from Varun where he said, I, Lelouch Lamperouge, command you to die. <laughs> <laughs> Which is, of course, a reference to the popular anime, Code Geass. Hey. Alright, did you smoke anything off? Uh, I have smokes for Boiler. Like, right on the top of it. 
Well, I feel like that'll let them know what's going on, right? Uh, not necessarily. It's pretty yeah, common to I'm smoke just, on I'm letting you know what I have in my throw, arsenal. Throw some, throw some smokes down. The, the, the basic ones. The basic ones. I don't know what that means. <laughs> but I it mean, meant something like, to Wally, apparently. I mean, yes. It's cause, <laughs> so I do have default smokes that I throw every single round in comp that are based off of the pros, you know, setups. I don't know if you consider that as the, the basic ones, though. Mm -hmm. It's we like they're a... taking a lot of space down A main. Oh. Uh, the full team is pushing into A while that nice the catching, are waiting. That nice catching Parachon might actually be a blessing in disguise because now they think they, they were in the A area when in fact they're all rushing B. Good flash. Doesn't really peek the corner, so not quite sure what that was for. But they are planning B site. And of course, on the other team... Full rush through mid, they have to spot him. There's Paul going down to ASDF pilot. This round has been a total map reversal, and now the defenders are playing full retake on the pistol. Yeah, not Asifa quite sure what's going Corey on there. Oh, my computer did a little bit of a weird thing. Uh oh, let's hope uh, the stream one... is fine. There it is. 1v3 for your lost dog. On slide, let's see if you can clutch this one out. Ooh, close, but oh, not quite. Not quite. I'm gonna go ahead and throw up a um, what the muck was that on that <laughs> round. That was a very strange play by both <laughs> teams, <agree>. but <laughs> you know, it, it paid off for, for one of them, I suppose. Seems like they're setting up for another mid push, but the Valpals have a couple more folks mid. Although, actually, my bad, it might be an A mid split. That flash on B reveals nothing for Mr. Clean. And the knife on B reveals even less. It seems like they are running back into an A push. It seems uh, Mr. Clean it is out. pushing out of B green. He might be able to, to catch someone, but of course, Corey has the turret on the flank. Really good play from him. Uh, your Lost Dog is anchoring on site A, and he gets taken out. Oh, man. We've got a pretty solid Team Buddy Squad Force site take coming on here. Now, let's see if... Team Valapals can retake the site. Yeah, we're looking at Tabi Show. Usually so good. He spots one Rafters. Oh, and he gets caught out with a stinger. Uh, oh. Asked if Pilot Burn takes, takes out, out one uh, in Rafters. It's a 2v4 in favor. 1v4 now. So let's see if Asked if Pilot can close this one out. And it would require he did an ace get clutch. an ace clutch before. That's one down. He hasn't even lost a lick of health. Pulling out the high tide. Trying to divide up that dangerous territory. Let's see if Sly Fox, or sorry, Mr. Clean can get this drop on him. Oh, and he dinks him, but not quite enough. Oh. That's another in the books for Team Buddy Squad Force. 9 5. Uh, once yeah, again, it seems not like, taking advantage of the ritual. Yeah, I'm, I'm really disappointed by both of these teams, honestly. They're both, they're both not really worthy of winning in my book. Oh, did Corey consider it? Has he considered it? He's pulled out his knife. Wally! Wally did it! Wally did the ritual. Rahul's doing oh, the ritual that's... too. It's spreading. We have two. We have two ritual goers. All right. All right. I'm supposed to be unbiased, but I'm going for. I'm going for Team Buddy Squad Force on that one. They've won my heart. Hey, let's sit mid again. I'll throw the bird again. Let's sit mid and see where they toss you till. <laughs> Holy shit. Hmm. I'm just, I'm, it's a surprising call out because I don't think any of the rest of us would make that call out. In a, oh, absolutely not. I would be. That's <laughs> literally what I say. <laughs> <laughs> Let's sit and, and wait for. Not to, to not to like, I'm not, not trying to give you suggestions or anything. I'm just saying I would call Rush a site every round because that I'm impatient. We're going to follow that smoke projectile and see where it goes. Lands right in mid. Doesn't pop it immediately, however. That's interesting. It looks like uh, VJ is preparing for a wall in tube, waiting on contact. Very interesting play. Can really slow down the attacking team. Oh, and Mr. Clean with a pick. VJ uh, is bound to be hearing them run through mid, but doesn't seem to be reacting. Could he be looking for a flank? He's potentially calming this to his team. He's really giving a lot of info. Uh, hopefully, they he understands really what's happening. You know, I'm not sure they gave that info to the team because of the harbor wall on A, given the rest of the people have just pushed into rafters. That
that's a good trade coming out. Uh, although the advantage is still on uh, Team Buddy Squad it's currently for us a in terms of the site take. It's going to be a three-on-three -three retake for uh, Team Valopals. Uh, luckily, they seem to be waiting for their team and playing together. Ooh, course, and the alarm bot catches out the people in screens. That sky flash, not going to see anything. Oh, but the rafters peak destroys them. And, of course, we have a harbor ult. Now, Wally, known for his post plants in these situations, can he clutch it out? He tosses the molly, but there's a sage wall. Incredible by the IGL of Valpals. And he's done it. Usage on that retake. Oh, and it's down to a 2v1 for the post plant. I don't think Sly Fox is going to risk that. Well, that's pretty good. What is it, 9-6? Oh shit, all right. Yeah, we Start should. Start rushing mid to A. A on night A. How is 23? Let's go around the back. Oh. This is a play. Poison's off. Okay. Dead. That's a vandal. That, that was on free money. Play. That was absolutely <laughs> insane, Paul. <laughs> oh, a bit of an unfortunate flash from Mr. Clean. And the knife does hit into B main. They'll be aware of that sky over there. Oh, it seems like Paul's team is just holding in spawn, expecting VJ's squad to push out at them. But it doesn't seem like that's going to be the case. There are a couple of dueling flashes in the B area. Juan has got the most aggressive position out of everyone, although it seems like Corey is peeking mid a little bit, jump spotting it, trying to see if he sees anything. Mr. Clean is uh, using the Trailblazer to clear the rest of B green. If he catches anybody, it could be a, a big uh, spot of information for the Valop House. That's a beautiful flash into Garage, catches Sly Fox, and now they know they're coming B. No, oh, he a spots big, a couple of them out. Big That's one, one down. He's backing off, giving them the rest of the site. If the rest of the team can come here for Oh, defense. that harbor wall just narrowly messing up the timing. Two hit behind yellow. Mr. Clean calls it out to his squad. That's the Reyna ult popped. Harbor wall in place. That's harbor down. While he's heading for the plant, but he can't avoid the boom bot. Aqua with There's really trade good after around. trade. He's, he's, he's dismissed a snowman and taken out uh, Thomas after the dismiss. Spotted out VJ. He gets caught in the slow. Oh, pulls out his knife. Just the wrong time, unfortunately. VJ catches him out. And they get the plant, but your lost dog cleans them up. I have to say, I've been very impressed with uh, VJ's utility usage this game. I've seen a lot of very clutch walls, and that slow in particular really slowed down a uh, and prevented him from taking over the round. Yeah, honestly, why doesn't he play like this in our ranked what? game? That's What's going crazy on? To me. <laughs> <laughs> I say after the plant. Another thing Let's to note in this round, up. the Team Buddy Squad Force is on a bit of a weaker buy. Uh, they have SMGs, while uh, Team Valop House is on a full buy. So hopefully they use their guns to their advantage. I'm going to watch Parachon here. I'm expecting him to call the ult, but hasn't happened as of yet. Corey's taking space up on belt. He's used the turret to uh, to clear rafters. There goes the Phoenix ult pushing through maze. Not going to spot anyone. Gets hit by that boom bot though. And he knows that people are headed rafters towards him. Spots out your lost dog in mid. Oh, but a bit of a whiff on the spray. Although Thomas is cleaning up. He's being healed by his team. The Viper's Pit has been popped after the plant. But he's caught out by the Sky Dog. Well done. And Thomas on the defuse fakes it. Takes out Paul. That was a very good retake. Not quite flawless, however. Wait. Oh, shit. Rip. What is that? Th it, does he have a Viper ult? What? Why yeah, do you guys say this champ sucks? He's so the, good. The Viper ult was us. Oh, but the, the purpley thing, right? The it covers so much. Wall. Wall. Oh. Yeah. And it lasts so long. Personally, I don't agree with people as saying far as Harbor folks is go, bad, that does not last Yeah, long. I don't I don't know why everyone keeps <laughs> saying he's, he's bad. bad. He's pretty agent. good. I just don't think people... There's no I, plan. 
Here's the thing, I think people say he's bad because none of us knows how to play him. Pretty solid on that front. And an important thing to note, uh, Juan is currently standing at the triple-double, so obviously very oh, important sheesh. for him. Uh, having a yeah, big that... impact on his team's rounds. He seems to be doing a bit of team damage. Juan is doing aim practice on a spray of a phoenix. Wonder if he's expressing some frustration with his IGL shot calling in this match. They haven't pushed out. They're using the flashes. Oh, here they come. Varun and Todd taking space in B green, grabbing the orb. Yeah, um, I'm going to watch them as well. I think that's that might be a pretty... Mm. Oh, Corey he gets killed by Corey on the retake. Uh, almost the charge up to there go the seekers oh and a raise ult into mid didn't quite catch that on my screen while he takes down chris however it's 4v oh 3v3. less 3v3 it uh, looks like the attackers are looking to move towards a while all the defenders are in b so good call from the igl there um todd a flash full flashes himself or juan i mean my apologies uh really <laughs> important play right there Planning up in Nest, pops the heels. They're going to be playing this out from the other side. I forget what it's called, Tower, I guess? Um, it looks like Harbor is looking to take some space in rafters. Um, he might not think to check the right corner where Paul is hiding. Well, VJ spots someone out, but he's running while shooting, and Juan takes no damage. Oh, spots out the rafters pick. That's really unfortunate. Oh, and it is now a 1v3 for Thomas. Can he clutch these out? Doesn't quite spot Juan. The oh, timing. The timing is just oh, so unfortunate. Oh, no. Will he see him at all? He doesn't. It's so unlucky. They for sure. Oh, he spots out Wally. Ooh, gets nice the pick. Shot, but he doesn't find the other two. Ooh. Ooh oh, got close. up to four. Got up to four. That's That was pretty good. I'm not going to lie. That was uh, more than I was expecting him to get. I don't know if I can say that. <laughs> oh, I see them. Oh no, I ran out of the bullets. Yes! Oh, oh let's go! Just some good no! You should have teabag again. I was trying to teabag, goddammit. <laughs> Alright, we've got a couple p different people playing on B than before. Mr. Clean pulling out that op on A. Not sure if it's going to be useful considering the positions of their uh, team buddy squad force. Seem to be going for a B push. Aqua, of course, getting spotted out by the Boombot in mid. Your Lost Dog is taking a bit of space here in, uh, in B green and gets a pick on oh, Archer. Oh, important. Pulls him down. Swarm Grenade clears out that cubby. There's a flash going in, and your lost dog takes the space, takes down Corey. That's a grenade kill in mid from Tommy Macho. What a beautiful flash. Double satchels. Uh, sits in mid. He might catch this A slash mid rotate. Oh, but the harbor wall stops him from seeing them. Man, shows really what a, what a, great what a uh, yeah, phenomenal agent. Oh, and Wally is playing a really interesting position. Let's see if Thomas gets caught by it. Oh, he spots him, but doesn't quite get the kill. Can he get traded? He got traded indeed. It's a 1v4 Let's for Let's see one. if Sly Fox, he he's one. got one. Dodges the other. He hears the A sign. Oh. oh, and the op finishes him off. Another solid round from the Valo Pals. That's 10-9. That flash me was not on my screen. There was two yeah. boiler. There was two boiler. <laughs> okay, play hide and seek. Just don't want to find you. <laughs> What is? How does that go so far? Alright. Okay. Molly, pop your wall. Toxins going up. And then go with. Oh, never mind. Oh no. Oh no. I was just play hide and seek. All right, one. Well, save your weapon. Oh, they have oh, oh, my. Cringe. Cringe. in this, so. Juan has made the call <laughs> cringe in chat, so he obviously not cringe. a fan of the op play. Uh, you know, 
There's there is a saying that we have with regards to Mr. Clean is that the op switches him around. What's his scoreboard right now? He is currently uh, twelve and fourteen. All right. Well, he's pulling out the op. Let's see if that makes him go positive or negative. It seems pretty even right now. They are on, on a, a full bit save. of a save. Yeah. Oh. This is a this is probably a pretty easy win. I'm gonna watch Thomas's perspective as he sends out the boom bot. Let's see where that boom bot goes. Oh, and it's shot down immediately by everyone in mid. That's a flash and a rain of blind. Thomas is completely blind. Satchel's his way out of there. That was beautiful. A harbor wall coming in from Kitchen. Takes down Paul. Oh, and he rips the rips the harbor ult, but is killed for it. We've got a couple people pushing through Kitchen. It's a 2v5, now a 1v5. Oh, sorry. I missed the entire other agent. Wally gets the plant off on A. Good for that plant money. Let's see if his post-plant situation can help him out here. I have Although to say, it does appear his odds are not great. Chris is on the flank. Thomas is right under him. Ooh. And he's taken out. Clean shot through the wall by Mr. Clean. Well and, done on that. And one. that's Developels tying up the game. 10 -10. That is 10 10. That's what we call a big oof in the RJ Gaming server. Like, through two. Oh, no. Hold on. Under, hold on. Hold on. Or... All of us run mid except Wally. Go A slowly and try and plant once you think they're all off site. So the rest of us are going like up two. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Right. Uh, go to go to tube if you can. All right, post up, post up, dodge the bullets. <laughs> oh no! Oh. <laughs> this fucking sucks. Defense is a little bit easier because you are reacting yeah. to what they're doing. Yeah, it it is a lot easier. <laughs> I think uh, some of that harbor util has been a bit of a throw. I've seen several timings messed up by the use of that cascade, but he's making up for it with his frags. He does appear to be heading to belt. Is he aware? Oh, I heard a second op. Who has that one? Rahul has an op as well. Uh, it appears Corey is using the turret before peeking. A very a smart play from him, and he spotted out uh, Todd with it. Um, Thomas is relaying his IGL's uh, strategy, which is quote "try to die." So uh, interesting. <laughs> try to die. Rahul. All right. Well, Rahul has done his job. It seems like getting killed by ASD of pilot. Currently a three v two in favor of the defenders. Uh, they seem to just be holding, but Chris is pushing out B main, and he's not going to let that stand. Really interesting play there by Chris to a full blind himself after flashing. So that's Thomas up on belt destroys Corey and can Wally take advantage of this? It's a flawless. We have our first netman flawless of the tournament. Uh, phenomenal play over here by the Valve Palace taking the lead. Move to B if we can. Never mind. There's someone in there. I I don't know. I don't know what to do. Just kill Todd if you can. He's on A. I knew he was up there as when I heard that. Get him! Get him, boy! <laughs> Sorry! <laughs> it appears he is preparing to lock down the site once again with the operator. Uh, on the other side, a bit of a light buy from the uh, team Bunny Squad Force. Joke's over! You're dead. Oh, we have a Phoenix ult all the way into B. Harbor is going to hear that. Let's see if it causes him to think that they are there. And look, you can see the Valo pals rotating. But <laughs> but Paul's team is rotating as well. Both teams are rotating into each other. That's a Reyna ult popped from Aqua. He blinds into sight. They've put up the wall, taking a lot of space near yellow. But there is a Sky ult and a Ray's ult. And he takes down the Reyna ult while getting killed. A good trade. That's the KO ult coming through. Oh my god. And the Valo pals are starting to run away with this one. They're on the defuse. And they've walled it off. They're pushing through, however. The bomb just gets to half. Your last dog is taken down from the Guardian. But he's rezzed. Oh, 
really interesting play from uh, VJ there. Ooh. A great bait res to uh, take down Corey. Uh, it seems like he's really taking advantage of his Sage utility. That's a lot of evidence of hours of practice there. Wow, there's no one here. Never mind, let's go this way. Come B. Oh, do you have a post? No, I'm dead. Oh, fucking Christ. I am one tap. And one. No! <laughs> <laughs> no Corey has post plant stuff. Maybe they start considering it. I see a knife pull by the pipes. But it doesn't doesn't look like it. Seems like they're going for A. I'm gonna take a look at Mr. Clean with the op, seeing if I'm gonna see if he can catch stuff. It looks like VJ may have read the A hole. He's playing not very heavy towards B, although never mind. As I say it, Harbor goes out to B with Sage, so one thing to keep in mind this round is the uh the Killjoy lockdown. Let's see if they take advantage of that to take the site. Oh, that's very true, very true. I see a smoke heading towards Todd's position. Does it block him off? And it does, forced to pull off the angle, but he gets a kill anyways. Unfortunate. Uh, looks like Corey is taking Thomas dropping the lockdown also here. has an off, gets a headshot. That was pretty good. We have a Killjoy ult coming through, trying to push these defenders off the site. They take out the opper, seems like a free site for the Team Buddy Squad Force. The Viper ult is popped. They don't want this to go down at all. Uh, Thomas, is Thomas is still destroying. in Raptors with the operator. Let's He's see. gotten. Oh, he shot at his teammate. Spots out Wally, gets a no scope. Oh, but Juan takes him down. Chris with the trade. And that's a defuse coming through. He's throwing a knife one last time. VJ is nodding to the chat. Oh, they're hitting the gritty on the bomb. Oh, no. Truly That's an unacceptable display of BM right here. A little bit of disrespect coming through, but hey, can you blame them? They won when they were pretty far down up at the start. We've had an interesting call from Paul in the chat. He says, I don't know what you mean by harbor is dog water. So perhaps he's questioning our decision on that one. All right. That is a round win. I think we should call the, uh, the players back into this call and have a little debrief on that round. Yep, let's do it. Uh, you want to try and add in the chat? Yeah.